What's going on everybody? It's your boy. I'm here to do something that I have like, I haven't done these since I think January. I'm gonna hit you guys with a tag video. Actually seven days worth of them. So you're gonna see in the video hashtag seven days of tag videos. Doesn't mean that I wanna do them on seven different days. It just means for seven days you guys are gonna get tag videos from yours truly. Alright? If you guys wanna do it, by all means join in. I will do my best to leave the uh, questions in the description box below. If I don't, just let me know and I'll add them in. All right. So, let's see which one. The, okay, so this one is the invade my privacy tag. <sighs> okay. Uh, did you wake up cranky? Uh, no, I really didn't. Uh, I think I get. Wait, you know what? Screw it, because I got to go through my phone for this. Uh, how many hours of sleep did I get last night? Uh,. Yeah, I got ten hours, like ten and a half hours of sleep last night. Don't actually, it really wasn't ten hours because I went, to, like, I laid down at uh, what seven twelve, and I didn't like really go to sleep until nine. So I pretty much slept from nine to five thirty this morning. So you do the math. But did I wake up cranky? No, I actually woke up quite refreshed and felt good. Felt real, real good. All right, going back to the questions. Would you date an 18 year old at your current age? 29? No, I, I can't. <laughs> I'll be 30 at the end of this year. And, I mean, it's a possibility, but maturity has to be there. And I mean, most people at 18, I'm, I'm not saying that people can't be mature, but people are still trying to live life or whatnot. And even though I tend to party like I'm still <laughs> in my early 20s and I'm in my late 20s right now, it's not something that I do on the regular, and you know, I, I just need that maturity, so, no. Nah. Um, do you prefer to be a friend, okay, do you prefer to be friends with girls or boys? Um, it really doesn't matter. I really, it, it, but I will say, like I said, I mean, it, it's weird, because, like, the shit has changed growing up, like, most of my company growing up were, uh, females. Pretty sure y'all can guess that, because, like I said, I'm very fucking flamboyant. Um... And that was because, like, dude, like, it's one of those ways, it's all, it tends to be the opposite. Like, you have a lot of females that have guy friends because girls keep up drama. Well, guess what? Guys keep up drama, too. And I rather really deal with, I don't know, it's weird. But right now, like, and then, I guess I want to say, like, my early 20s, it was like a balance between the two. Right now, eh, most of guys, you know. But at the same exact time, I think I have, like, friends right now where, you know, we have a lot of the same, um, I guess opinions on things and whatnot, so the maturity level is there, and it's like we're not keeping up drama and whatnot. So, right now, uh, boys, um, would you ever smile at a stranger? Yeah, I do all the time. If I walk past my, I mean, I smile and I greet everybody that walk past now. Do they respond back? Fuck no, but I mean, it is what it is. I do like to think that sometimes you can be the difference in somebody's life and sometimes just having somebody to you know be happy towards them be like good morning or how are you you know just something like that i mean you never know you could brighten somebody's day so i try to smile and i do smile a lot at people that i don't even fucking know so there's that how do you look right now a hot ass mess <laughs> it's been a long fucking day like i don't even have my dang on fro and whatnot paid out it's been a long ass day it is what it is um what exactly are you wearing right now? Okay, I am all types of fucked up. So I have on this little fucking, you know, shirt right here. And then I have on some damn um, gym shorts. <laughs> I'm, in the, I'm in the crib chilling, okay? So I ain't trying to look any kind of fucking way. Like, I'm not going away right now. Um, let me see. How often do you listen to music? Every fucking day. Every fucking day I'm listening to some form of music. It used to be, um, I want to say, back in, in between, what, 2009 to about the 2013 that I would wake up and literally have my headphones on. And I'm getting back into that. But you'll have my headphones on and just do that as I'm getting up, getting ready to go work out and all the other good jazz. But I listen to music every day. Um, do you wear jeans or sweats? Well, I tend to work out a lot, so I tend to wear um, sweats and, you know, uh, gym shorts. Well, one is gym shorts now because it's actually warm. Uh, when it gets a little bit cooler, then, you know, like the longer, uh, like the jogging pants and whatnot, and then when it gets cold, 
probably not gonna be outside. No, nah, I will still be outside. I got something to work out and shit, but I don't really wear jeans all that much. And it's only because like I'm like when I go out and I'm trying to get back out and being social, I go out to work out. <laughs> like I'm a recluse. Y'all may not think that, y'all may not see it, but I'm really a recluse. So I don't really like going out and being out shit. Just nah. Um Do you think your life will change dramatically before 2017? Well, there's been a lot of drastic changes in my life thus far this year. So, I mean, there's several more months left. I hope so. I'm hoping for a promotion to happen in the next couple of months um, and other things. And I don't know. We'll see. We might have to revisit this, like, you know, uh, tag video and just, I guess, catch up maybe. Maybe just for that question. I, I don't know. Are you are you a social or anti-social person? Okay, so here's the thing. If I'm out and about, I, I I'm trying to figure out the best way to explain this. Like, I like to be by myself. You know, honestly, I like to be by myself. I like my own little circle. This, that, and the third. I go days on end without actually engaging with people. Uh, like family or friends will tell you Yarell is bad with calling people like I am so horrible with that I'm bad with texting people you know like, it's just me being honest like, it's something that I work on but I'm just I'm used to being myself but if I'm out and about I can become a social butterfly but that's only for a given duration of time if I'm out for a prolonged period of time i.e. Uh, when I go and feel problems and whatnot, because I'm so used to my own space and I don't have it I don't I, I literally am not social anymore. like I just kind of like tuck myself on in until I kind of get the time to kind of come back in Michelle so hopefully I answered that question um if the person you like say they like someone else what would you say okay <laughs> like I'm, I'm not against rejection I mean if, if I say hey I like you they'd be like okay well I like this person <laughs> or I don't like you okay <laughs> shit I'm grown I mean shit happens but um are you good at hiding your feelings it depends on if I'm trying to more often than not I don't say a lot of things cause I cut people with my tongue I like to show how I'm feeling so it's one of those where if I'm mad you can see like okay he don't wanna fucking be bothered but if I have to I can put on a poker face and move about shit as if ain't nothing happening and I could I do that a lot especially when I don't want anybody in my business but I mean something but I mean even like I'm very transparent so I'm at the point in my life now where I really don't have my feelings it's just you can pretty much see it but there are certain things uh, when things happen in my life I don't always want and need people uh, in my life uh, good example is a promotion was supposed to happen for me and things just went left and it's, it was pretty much like a legality type of thing where I didn't know that I had so much time to you know re-enlist and all this other stuff so I missed out on it so I had to get recycled through and I'm not hitting the list and all this other stuff and a lot of people are looking at me like man you take it quite well and it was one of those where I'm taking it quite well because I'm having health issues right now like I'm upset about this, don't get me wrong, but I care more about my health because that's, you know, when my fracture rear was a big issue and all the coughing and everything. Nah. But, yeah, there you go. Can you drive a stick ship? <laughs> nope. Strictly automatic. <laughs> okay, let's stop with the embarrassing questions, please. Do you care if people talk badly about you? No. Uh, and it's mostly because people do it anyway. You know what I'm saying? So I really don't care. I prefer, you know, if somebody got to say, will have something to say, I mean, just say it to me, address me. But I really don't fucking care. A lot of it happens both on the YT and just in, well, the YT, my professional life, my private life, just in every aspect of my life it happens. So, I mean, I really don't care. Plus, my whole thing is this. I mean, if you're allowing me to rent space in your mind, Thank you so very much. I mean, apparently I'm a hot topic. <laughs> what else? Uh, na, 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 na. Are you going out of town soon? Nah. I'm probably not going to go any. Like, the farthest that I'm probably going to go is probably going to be um, Jacksonville, North Carolina. It's probably the farthest I'm going to go. I really wouldn't consider Well, I mean, that is out of town, but not really. And then it'll probably be for Thanksgiving, maybe. 
but I think my next trip is probably going to be in yeah in September when uh, I'll go back home to Chicago probably for two weeks and then I'll actually be going to Germany uh, shortly thereafter <clears throat> so yeah but like immediately right now no um when was the last time you cried <laughs> Whoo, May it, it was it was definitely May for those who don't who don't know don't remember whatever like I said my father passed away uh, right about mid-May and yeah <laughs> That it brought a lot of feelings out, uh, a lot, a lot of, just a lot of shit. So that was the last time. Um, have you ever liked someone you didn't expect to? If we're talking about relate, like in terms of like infatuation, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I, I will say yeah. And in terms of just like general friendship, yes. And really enough, with the whole friendship thing, I've noticed that if I like somebody right away, typically those relationships tend to go south. Like if it's like an immediate, just like, oh shit, we hit it all. Not always, but sometimes. And then those relationships where me and a person, we end up just not fucking liking each other in the very beginning. Those tend to be some of the best friendships that I've ever had. And I got some best friends right now when I was in college. We couldn't fucking stand each other. And I mean, look, I don't know how it happened, but look at God, like we are still friends to this day. So, you know, just throw it out there. Uh, how many more questions? If you could change your eye cup, okay, would you? No, I mean, now I had asked if I would change it, what color I would change it to, it would be blue only because blue is my favorite fucking color. But I wouldn't change my eye color only because, I mean, I like how I am. <laughs> like, I think just everything about me just compliments itself, so I wouldn't change that. And last thing, name something you have to do tomorrow. Not necessarily tomorrow, but within the next few days, I gotta take some stuff to my storage unit. Uh, also, I, well, actually, I have to study for the board tomorrow, because that shit's going down next week gotta go outside and go for a walk you know I, I gotta get everything well actually I lost a lot of weight being sick I'm, I lost about a good 15 pounds that shit was crazy but I still gotta get everything back like now that my health is improved I gotta get back out into working out and whatnot. so yeah pretty much what I have to do tomorrow so that's it you guys quick tag video like I said doing seven days of tag videos alright if you guys want to do it by all means jump right ahead on in and do them and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.